Hey folks, Sheila here from Design Files. In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can use your brand new time tracker to track all the hours you spend on a project and then take that time and add it directly to an invoice so you can bill your client for the time spent. So let's go ahead, we're gonna jump right in and I'll show you exactly how this works. Now when you log into your Design Files account, you're gonna see your new time tracker up here at the top of the page. And if you wanna activate it, all you have to do is click on it, you'll be able to select the project that you wanna work on and then you can just add in a note indicating what task you're working on. When you're ready, click the button to start the timer, and that's it. This thing is now running and it's tracking all of your time. If you wanna hide this panel, just click anywhere outside of it and you can get straight to work. And when you're ready and you've completed that task, you can just come all the way back up to your timer. You're gonna hit the pause button to stop the timer. Now, if you're wondering why this isn't counting up the seconds, don't worry about it. It doesn't count up in seconds. Your time is gonna show as a decimal amount and I'll touch more on that in just a second. Now, if you want to be able to see how much time you're spending on a project as a whole, you can go into the more option right here, go down to the time tracker, and that's gonna take you to your time tracker overview page. And here you're gonna see all the individual entries and how much time you've been spending on each and every one of those tasks. Now here you can see the time broken down as a decimal number. So if you see 2.75, that means you spent two hours and 45 minutes on this particular task. Now, a couple things to just discuss here. Let's say that you were sourcing products uh, on a particular day for this project. You spent four hours sourcing the products, you broke for lunch, and you came back and you ended up putting in an extra hour of sourcing products for this project, but you forgot to turn on your timer. If that ever happens to you, don't worry about it because you can edit all of these entries. All you have to do is click on this icon right here. You can update the time to include the extra time that you spent, and then you can update the entry. You also have the ability to just remove any of these entries if you want to by clicking on the trash can icon. Now let's say that I'm ready to go ahead and send an invoice out to my client and I want to include all of these billable hours. So what I would do is I'm just gonna make sure that I stop any timers that are running and then I'm gonna go straight up to the invoices and I'm gonna create a brand new invoice. And in the invoice template, you're gonna see at the bottom that you have the ability to add products from the project. You can add manual line items and now you have the ability to add in all of your tracked hours as well. So if you click on that, it's gonna open up this panel right here and it's gonna give you the option to include all the uninvoiced hours from this project or you can break it down by a particular time range but I'm gonna go ahead and add all of them. And then I'll just put in my hourly rate, add them to the invoice, and everything immediately gets added in and calculated up for you. So definitely hop into your Design Files account and give this new feature a try. It's been heavily requested by our membership. I know it's gonna make your life a lot easier, especially if you've been manually tracking your hours up until this point. This is gonna get you, this is gonna provide you with a much more streamlined uh, process and make it so much easier for you for all of your projects. So hop in, give it a try. As always, let us know what you think. And thanks so much for watching.